everyone, it is I, Marcus W. Welcome back to my channel. You join me at Glengarry Hall in Newcastle. Uh, this is an artificial intelligent computer called Amy. Say hello, Amy. Hello, viewers. Welcome back to Mark's channel. Please subscribe if you are not already. And don't forget to press the notification bell as well. She was a prisoner of the Skull Hackers, but she managed to escape because she can program any electrical device in the world. And she managed to transmit herself here. Because this used to be the home of Professor Black, Amy's creator, but he passed away during the 2020 pandemic. While Amy was a prisoner of the Skull, she managed to find out some useful information about them. And one of them in particular is the location of their headquarters, which we know is somewhere in the Pennines. But what kind of defences does it have, Amy? Well, Mark, their radar has a maximum range of a 20 mile radius. To launch a ground attack will be difficult because their ground is fitted with motion detectors. But the good news is that there are no landmines. What about from the air? Because Maya told me that they only have one aircraft, the Skull Basher. One wouldn't be enough to take out a whole squadron, even in several missiles. Unfortunately, the Plague Hackers have donated a fleet of attack helicopters with orders to shoot down any aircraft approaching the base. That's usually the first line of defense. The second line of defense are ground to air laser turrets. Not only can we take out aircraft, but they can also intercept missiles. Ah, that is a problem. Well, I need to send this information to Miss H so she can do some sort of reconnaissance and try and pinpoint the location. Then we've got the question of how do we get through those defences. It will take something very special. Sorry to change the subject, Mark, but my senses are picking up something approaching the hall. Oh, we have a visitor. Insufficient data? All I'm detecting is a massive power source. Whatever this visitor is, it is not human. Well, whatever it is, I think it's in. What are you going to do, Mark? Well, I'm going to investigate. But first, I should probably hide your module, because if this visitor is hostile, we don't want him, her, or they taking it. Wait. Before you turn me off, do you have a Spy Ninja Covert communicator? Uh, yeah, I do. Hang on, it's in my pocket. Yeah, here it is. What did you have in mind? I can digitally transfer myself to the device, so you can stay in touch with me. Well, that's clever. So, she'll be inside the Covert communicator. Okay, so um, what do I do? Because I don't know how these controls work. Press the buttons marked. Five, one, two, eight. Five, one, two, eight. Tune the frequency control to channel E. Channel E. Now press the big red button and just give me a few seconds. Red button. It is done. You can turn off the module now. Okay. Amy, can you hear me? Affirmative. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Right, let's investigate. <laughs> what is that thing? Who are you? What are you doing here? Do you want to play? Uh, no, thanks. Come on, just want to play. It'll be fun. I think I'll take a rain check on that. What are you? Come on. Destroy mode? Yep. She won't stop until the time to destroy. Good. Then let the games begin. 
Amy. What the hell was that? It appears to be a life-size version of a cyber door. The energy readings I was detecting must have been its power source. Where That's not gonna work! Push the big gun, won't affect me. Damn it. Oh, no. I'm coming to get you. Over my dead body? Oh, my gun has no effect on her. How am I gonna stop her? Any ideas, Amy? I've managed to scan the cyber doll and I have found some weaknesses. The doll's headband is an antenna. Remove it and it will be more vulnerable. Another option weakness is that it is not fully waterproof. If you can lure her to the bathroom. No, no, we can't use water. If she's like the other cyber dolls, then she'll be powered by the cesium batteries and that's more powerful than lithium batteries. If I try and use water on her, the whole place could go up. Is there another weakness? An electrical weapon like a Taza should disable the door. If I can get my stun chucks, maybe that might affect her. Seems quiet. I'll just have to keep trying my gun. There's a friend behind you. It's not working. It's having some effect, but not enough. There is another way. If I can supercharge the communicator's magnet, it should interfere with its circuit. Okay, I'll try again. Here she comes. about that take the compass out first mark there I'll take the compass out see now it's away from the magnet it's pointing north when I bring it close the magnet interferes with the compass that should be enough if Amy can supercharge it no problem where is she Now, Mark. Now. What's going on? Oh, I'm picking up a lot of magnetic interference. Um, Quick, Mark. Remove the headband antenna. The antenna. No function. No function. We are losing the signal. Reconnect it. I'm trying to, man. Yeah. 
say hello to the scrapyard. You know what? We lost it. Whew, that was close. At least I get its toy now. Now, let's see if we can find out what makes her tick. I think it's all right, guys. It's totally deactivated. Now, let's open her up. Yep, I found a hatch. It looks very complex. Wait a minute. This circuit board is loose. I might be able to pull it out. <clears throat> I think this must be the command circuit. Wait a minute. Some writing on it. There's a computer chip here that says Interlock Entertainment. Hmm. I've heard that name before. I need to check things out with Amy. Whew. Thank God that's over. So, we got the gun. Nice work with the magnet, Amy. You're welcome, Mark. Here's the uh, circuit I managed to rip out. And you see, Interlock Entertainment. I mentioned them in some of my previous videos. Interlock Entertainment is the Skull's front. They hack YouTube channels and the YouTubers can only get them back if they pay a million pounds or dollars, depending on where they live. That explains how the Skull have been getting the money to build some of this advanced technology. Where is Interlock Entertainment located? IE has been set up all over the world, but their building in London is their main base. Maybe if I go there, can take down Interlock Entertainment once and for all. Put an end to the Skull's front. It's worth a try, but I still gotta complete my mission here to fight the ultimate monster. And no, the Cyber Doll's not the ultimate monster. There's something even nastier coming. In the meantime, Amy and I will get on with studying this circuit. Guys, do give this video a thumbs up because I do appreciate your support. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you know when I next upload the video because my adventures are getting more serious and difficult. Once I've taken down the ultimate monster, I'll go to Infoc Entertainment and uh, see what chaos I can cause there for the hackers. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. Over and out.